So these are two of uh, four woodies that I've shot this morning. These two, I'm doing slightly different to normal because I uh, I want these for a cooking video that I'm going to be doing. So I've done, I've, I've obviously gutted them. And what I'm going to do now, I'm going to spatchcock this. So I'm just going to cut straight up there with these pair of secateurs. If I've left crop in this one, so I'm after, I have. So I've got some crop in there, so I'll clean that out when I've done this anyway. So basically, straight up backbone. Either side of backbone. I don't know if I'm doing this right to be honest with you. I've seen it a couple of times, but I'll give it my best go. That's backbone. So crop out the other one, I forgot this one, so just cut it out. Simple to do, as long as you know what you're doing. It's going to be anyhow. See what it's been eating. Some of the farmers' crops, that's why they were shot. Said they were hammering his crops. Now he grows stuff for cattle feed, pig feed, all that kind of stuff. What do now? Just break that breastbone, and that. What's a bit clean? That's a little bit of lungs there, and that'll go on barbecue, nice and flat. Like that, cook all the way through. Let's do the next one quickly. I'll get that one to tidy up. So, peach side of backbone. Okay, crunchy throat bones. Esophagus forward and lungs. I keep nest on my chopping board rather than along my kitchen side. Same thing with this one. Tied it, mess out it. I might do with that one step further. One step further. I'll just cut these little bones out here. They are sharp little buggers, then. It's part of a rib cage, but looks at it. I'll take them out if I want to get any. I'll come up this side here. Trying to keep carcass intact as well as take these out. They are sharp little ribs. That's that one done. Perfect. Like I said, just goes flat on barbecue. 
I'll show you better. I'll just go and barbecue water that now. Perfect. Let's tidy this last one up. Be squeamish. Philip, if you're watching, or not. Because <laughs> I know you are fit. squeamish, mate. Don't watch this bit, just skip to cooking part. It's a bit of a blood clot. Let's see if I might be shot. Same thing with this. Cut these away. I'm glad I've seen these ribs actually and took them out. Definitely not want to be eating them, but you won't be eating undecided anyway, to be fair, so I could have left them, but. Same way out when you're deboning it. Just follow the natural bone line. It's quite easy. Yeah, we're done. Just needs a wash. And it's ready for barbecue. That's them all done. They've had a clean up, wash up, two wood pigeon, spatch cooked, ready for a nice, delicious meal.